Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host, Airsoft Al, and recently, uh, I did a live stream a long time ago, and they were asking me, uh, why I play in a gas mask, and really, it's a question I've been thinking about for a while now, and this happened, and this was back in January, uh, not January, this was back in December, I believe I did this live stream a long time ago, and really it's a good question. Why play in a gas mask? Well, much like when marriage or any long-term relationship, you kind of spice it up, or it gets stale. But one of the biggest reasons why I love playing in a gas, why I want to play in a gas mask, is because well, with airsoft, we're kind of starting to get a little stale, aren't we? It's time for me to spice it up a bit, not in the kinky way, of course. <laughs> oh my. Anyway, <laughs> uh, but yes. If you've seen my how to make gas mask safe video, this is like the cheapest way for me to make this style of gas mask, well, the style of lens, basically, safe, but either way. Why I like playing in a gas mask is basically, well, I'm basically taking on the gas mask challenge, where you have to do a full activity in a gas mask. And really, it's fun. It really is. Uh, like, it's a challenge. I love a challenge. I can't keep myself from doing a challenge. It's it's that addicting to do a challenge. Like, if ever, if ever you've done the impossible quiz, or the impossible game, or anything of that nature, where it's like a real challenge, then my god, that's what puts your skill to the test. And this is a real challenge. I like messing around with gas masks. I am a military collector and a military historian. A little bit. I'm slowly getting back into those roots, because I've been lazy for a long time. Uh, but either way, not only that, but I love collecting gas masks, and I also like collecting uh, certain more or less guns. And playing in a gas mask, it definitely adds a level of challenge that I sorely lacked in Airsoft. Although, having a field not close enough to actually play Airsoft is one, but uh, it's, it's not that anyway. <clears throat> but... Seriously though, playing in a gas mask is probably the most challenging thing ever because, one, your peripheral view is cut to a certain degree, uh, your breathing is slowed down, you have to take things a little bit more cautiously because, uh, depending on the design of the gas mask, it's how it is, and more or less, playing in a gas mask offers a lot more protection to the face because, hello, you have this big thing covering your face. Uh, not only that, but it gives you a sort of peek into how men who fought in gas masks actually, um, I'm trying to think, uh, it's, uh, it's difficult. Say the least. If you actually go down to the description, or at least go to the card up here, you'll see a uh, a link to a playlist of all my gas mask videos as of far. The first video is me taking on the gas mask challenge, playing in the Czechoslovakian M10M, and I am going to be releasing videos on my thoughts on that gas mask, even though everyone knows that the cheek filter gas mask. Yeah, and a lot of people are fans of cheap filter gas masks, but there are some who have a love-hate relationship with it, like I do, but that's a totally different video for another day. But... Best way I can describe playing in a gas mask is a very healthy challenge to actually take on. Now, don't use the original filters with it, those contain asbestos, please get the modern Polish or modern Russian filters, because old Warshaw pack filters and things like that, those things take 40 millimeter gauss, which is not 40 millimeter NATO threading, sad to say, but uh, <clears throat> either way though. Uh, but yeah, I want to know if there are anyone else out there who actually plays in a gas mask, and if you do play in a gas mask, let me know in the comment section down below if what I said actually does resonate with you or uh, what you think. Uh, you know, playing in a gas mask, but basically, do you believe playing in a gas mask gives you a better challenge to airsoft, gives you a new level of uh, fun and experience to airsoft, because believe me, 
as much as we like to say, oh, Airsoft's changing, it's evolving, it's it's still good, in reality, we need to try stuff like this to really help spice things up. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. As always, I've been Airsoft Al, and if there are anyone out there who actually collects gas masks as well and wants to help me out, uh, contact me uh, either through Facebook or, or Discord, and as always, guys, uh, Thank you all for watching. I've been Airsoft Isle, and I'll see all you lovely people in the next video. Until next time.